Hello everybody, Nick Grimshaw here, and it's another episode of Getting Out from Between the Lines, Ideas for Escaping Conventional Thinking. And I love to start, I'm kind of a quote guy, so I love to start with a quote. And my quote today is from Pablo Picasso, and he said, I am always doing that which I cannot do in order to learn how to do it. I'll give you that again. I am always doing what I cannot do in order to learn how to do it. Does that describe what you're doing today? Does that describe part of your job as an entrepreneur and as a business person? One of the things I use to get out of that thinking, that that narrow thinking, get out from between the lines, is I use flip chart paper. And if you're having trouble trying to work your way through something, this is a really great way to go. It's a way of thinking out loud. And you've got big sheet to work on so you can really get into it, scribble. I like something like this rather than working in a little tiny notebook and trying to work through something. Now, um, everybody has their own method. This is just an idea of something that you can use to work through something you want to do, something you want to try, something you're trying to learn how to do. Take a moment and work it now. I went through several iterations of this and basically what it is is a flow chart for how I want to drive traffic to a particular lead page, lead capture page. And so I wanted to look at the types of traffic that I had access to and then where I wanted that traffic to go and what happens when they get to my lead capture page and once they sign up, what sort of things are going to happen once they sign up. So, um, so and, and I included, I stretched myself because these are things that, that I don't really spend a lot of time thinking about how, how does that lead capture page going to work for me and exactly what do I want it to do. And this is a great way of working out your thoughts. And use color. I didn't use a lot of color here. This is all in black. But sometimes using color uh, gives you more of a creative bent to what you're doing. And it's sort of a mind map, but it's not really a mind map, but it's kind of, it falls in that. But here's the thing. If you want to think outside of what you know and where you're at, do something different to work through it. And that's my example for today. Okay, have an awesome day. Dream big. Live inspired.